Hi, I'm Nicholas for JuniorEurosum.net and we are here with Emilia from Serbia. Now, hi, Emilia. Um, you just finished your second rehearsal, right? How did it go? Uh, it went great. We had a uh, little corrections, so we were working on that and it was great in general, yes. Corrections, is there anything that needs to be fixed or is it... No, it done. was it was uh, changed. It was changed already. Yeah, it was okay, changed. great. Now, when you're at that piano and when you're walking on stage, you seem very calm. Are you actually calm or are you actually really nervous inside? No, I'm not really nervous. I just have I am a little nervous, but in general I'm calm and I try to be because it's really important to focus focus on the main thing. Yeah. Do you have any special thing that you do before you go on stage to get rid of those nerves, to be calm? Is there anything special or just go for it? No, I just focus and go. <laughs> That's very good. Now, last night you did the theme song rehearsal, the group song. Um, how was that to record it with everyone? How was the experience? It was great. Uh, all of us um, co- came to the studio and uh, every one of us uh, recorded their part. So it was quick and it was nice and <laughs> Do you remember what line you sang? And if so, can you sing your line? It's really short, so it would be... I don't know if I should sing it, because it's really short. If you want to, if you don't want to, it's fine. (laughs) It's really short. It's really short. We'll hear it on Saturday in any case. Now, last night after that rehearsal, you also went to Euroclub. We saw you there. Um, Now, how was Euroclub? How was the party? It was really great. I I love the music, because Mm. it was so... I know, it was exciting and everybody was there, so yes, it was fun. Yeah, have you made any friends in particular yet, like friends from here that you will keep in contact with after junior? Mm, yes, we all exchanged our contacts and we're trying to be, we are friends and <laughs> we're going to keep in touch after Eurovision. That's very nice to hear. Now, um, how are you enjoying Mal- Malta? What have you done so far in Malta? You finished the school, is that right, or not yet? Uh, no, no, I didn't finish school no. yet. But, what have you done so far? Um, but I've been, I've been <laughs> to Valletta and yes. to Slima, and yeah. I really loved it. I haven't got so uh, so much time for sightseeing, yes. but but um, so far what I've seen was really beautiful. And what was your favorite thing? My favorite thing uh, was Valletta. I'd have mm-hmm. to say it is really pretty. Now about Junior, what is what is your goal here for this week? Do you have a goal? Uh, yes, I have. My goal is to have fun and uh, to meet lo- uh, so many new people. But it seems like you've already met yes. a lot of people. And, so. and are you having fun? Yes. Okay, then that goal is almost achieved. <laughs> yes. Now, Serbia is very successful at adult Eurovision and as well as a junior with um, um, Charo Mlanoc being third, etc. Does that put a lot of pressure on you? No, because uh, the delegation is really helping me and they're very supportive and I'm just trying to represent my country in the best way that I can and I'm, I'm not, so they're not pushing me. It's just, it's just a great experience and I'll try to be best. Mm-hmm. That's, that's very good because you need indeed to enjoy it most yes. of all. Now, would you ever want to go to adult Eurovision one day? Of course, it would be such a pleasure and an honor, but we'll see. I'm too young. We'll see. Do you have any favorite Eurovision songs or junior Eurovision songs? I couldn't pick just one. That would be rude. (laughs) Okay, I get that. Now, what is your biggest dream in life? My biggest dream? Oh, that's hard. I never thought about it. Um, I don't know. I just want to find something that I love doing. So it wouldn't be boring. It wouldn't be boring just to come to work and dislike something that I'm doing. I want to find something that I'll do every day and I'll be happy. With. And is singing a possibility then? A possibility, yes. yes. Or piano playing because you also play the piano. How long have you been playing the piano now? Uh, eight, years. eight years. Yes, and I I really love playing piano. It relaxes me and. It just makes me happy. Well, maybe that's why you're so calm on stage. The piano soothes you. Now, um, do you want to sing part of your song? Or would you... If you you, want to. Yeah, you can choose any part of your song. Uh, Go ahead. You can hold the microphone if you want to. Okay, whatever. It's heavy. (laughs) (laughs) Ne mogu da sakrijem 
Usnovi ma pitam se vidiš li da si ti svet u mojim očima that was gorgeous especially that end i love the bit where you go Sphere. that that's my favorite part of the song now what is the message of the song really i know it's called world in your eyes in english but is there a message behind it uh yes it's about um, the early love when you're still young and you're not sure sure what you feel and you're not sure what the other person you're in love with feels so it's it's um I don't know how would I say that, but it's it's really nice and it's a ballad, so I really yeah. like. Okay, thank you very much for this thank interview. You. Just to finish, do you have a message to our viewers? Just one thing you'd like to say to all the people watching this interview? Okay, so um, if you if you like my song, vote for me and see you at Saturday. Oh, they will vote for you. Thank you very much for this interview, thank and you. we'll see you around. Thank you very much. Thank you.